founder of 1-800-SNORING. Larry, good morning. Good morning. Okay, before we start, let's have it all play around. Raul, anybody, raise your hand if you think you snore. Okay, that's what I expect. I think so. Okay, Raul thinks he snores. Chrissy doesn't think he snores. Do you snore at home? Uh, either way, whether you snore or not, what causes so, snoring to begin with, Larry? Snor snoring is the start of the airwave closing. So if you imagine you, you, the top here, it's starting to close, and when it closes, it, it constricts the airwave and it starts vibrating the tissue. Sleep apnea is a full closure of the airwave. So starting to close the airwave is snoring, and it starts to vibrate. And, and, a full and that's closure. where, and then mm. there's different types of snoring, right? There's a... They're the, yeah, there's, there's, that, that's the basic level of closure. So imagine mm -hmm. snoring like a musical instrument. Okay. If a musical instrument has different high pitches, so uh -huh. based on how the airflow is happening, that's okay. what's going to close it. But snoring is just annoying. Sleep apnea, which is what we're going to talk a little bit about, is dangerous. What is sleep apnea? Sleep apnea is a full closure of the airway. When the airway closes and you hear that, you know, when they stop snoring, like, <clears throat> that, that's a noise where they... they woke up and they tried to figure out what's happening. There's tests now like this. It actually goes on your head. Okay. And this one goes like this. I'll, I'll show you. Here, why don't I hold this? And you, you do that. that. And so this one goes above your head and you sleep for one night like this. On your head? On your head. Or there's lots of different ones. You don't have to go to a sleep center anymore. Okay. And it will tell you if you have sleep apnea. Sleep apnea is when the full closure happens and then the body sends electrical pulses and the heart starts pumping faster. Okay. And it's no coincidence that snoring and, and sleep apnea has the same correlation as heart attacks at night, between 11 at night and 4 a.m. Because when the body jumps to right. wake you up, uh -huh. it's, it's starting it up, and sometimes it puts it into a bad rhythm. Oh, wow, now, that's scary. Yeah, exactly. And that's why you should call your doctor or call us at 1-800-SNORING and find out if this is really a problem, if it's an annoyance or really something in there. Now, they can do a lot of different things uh -huh. to That's fix what the I was going to ask. Let's say you have a partner that snores and it affects the way that, uh, that you're sleeping at night. What can, you, what can you do? Well, once they get tested, they can figure out which way to do it. I mean, there's things like, um, I don't know how this one works, but this is a sprayology. There's a spray thing here. There's what different, are these? These are different appliances. This is like an adult baby binky. Basically, you put it in your mouth. I know. But... It's one way to do it. While you sleep it? Yeah, you put it in your mouth uh, on this one. This is like a dental retainer, and so basically you put it in your mouth, and it pushes the jaw slightly forward so the tongue's out of the way. A lot of people say they sleep and snore when they're on their back, right? Well, this helps the tongue from falling back, blue, pink. And then this is a CPAP machine. Uh, you see thing. these on? Yeah, this is ResMed. They're actually down the street from you guys. They're a great company to work with. Oh, and Kearney Mesa, cool. Yeah, yeah, okay. big company. They, they support with these masks, and no longer do people have to worry about these big masks. They've actually condensed it down, and there's a new company out that, that has it this way, and it connects. And so it's just a small little mouthpiece, goes in on this. And when you take care of your sleep apnea, it starts your metabolism again. It helps you reduce hypertension, diabetes, strokes. It helps reduce it because all these things are causing that, and it actually helps your metabolism go faster. And some people have been telling me they lose a lot of weight when they go on one of these ways to help reduce it because the body's not waking up and staying refreshed. Well, Larry, thanks for coming in. And again, if you want more information, because I know that this affects a lot of people. It really does. If it doesn't affect you, it'll affect somebody else. Uh, we have information on how you can find the 1-800-SNORING. It's up on our website, fox5sandiego.com. And it's pretty cool because a little later this week, Chrissy will be live at a sleep center with more on helping you sound or sleepily, sleep, sound. You, you know what I mean. Soundly Look, sleep. I'm because I'm falling asleep right now. Right. Larry, I slept three hours last night. Well, you definitely need something. Because I'm growing a human, and it makes me tired. <laughs> but you know, that's that's what. That was kind of awkward. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, it's seven twenty-seven. Well, none of us get enough sleep around here, and you poor thing. I feel bad for you. Seven twenty. I feel bad for all of you.